Okay, hey, my name is Doug, and I'm gonna make a video about how to move a giant boulder from one side of your property to another. So this is like uh, maybe 50, 75 yards or something like that. Um, if you, I have a link in the description for the video where I pried this boulder with my kids out of the ground over here in our garden. So yeah, this boulder, like you could just see like maybe the, maybe the top of it. So me and my kids pried it out of the ground, but this thing is so heavy that, he, I mean, you can't re even really roll it or, so I have this sled that I made, I call it a, a rock sled. Uh, it's exclusively for rocks <laughs> and it might work in the winter too. I don't know, but for a sledding, normal sledding. Um, uh, you know, not too much detail on this. You can see this front, I have for the runners, I have this PVC pipe that I just like cut lengthwise and then like kind of snapped onto the front. So I think this is gonna probably tear up our lawn a little bit regardless, but we'll see how this goes. I, I've never done this before. This is like live, you're seeing it live. So if I mess up, you know, it's on video, so it doesn't really matter. I can just edit it out, right? Uh, uh, so yeah, we, if you're doing this, uh, watch out for where your septic tank is, I think. That might be an old wives tale, I don't know, but you probably don't wanna drive over your septic tank, so. I'm carefully avoiding our septic tank and uh, yeah, so that's about it. I'm gonna hop in the car now. I'm kind of nervous, but we'll see how this goes. <laughs> All right, Aga's gonna follow behind me and- uh, yeah. Bring the dog. The dog has to come to the car otherwise. I'm not gonna be happy. Well, so far, so good. <laughs> okay, slow, slow, slow. Watch out for my plants or I'll kill you. <laughs> I've got some squash in here. I don't want him to run over my squash. Uh huh. If you see the rock like rolling towards the car, like Indiana Jones, then let me know. Indiana Jones, okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, I guess I'm good. One pipe fell off. Is that okay? <laughs> Still on, Doug? Yep. How was the yard? We um, it's fine. The PVC pipe is just missing. One of it. One of it. So yeah, we're going to... We moved our little bonfire place from up the hill right there where you see the rock and we're going to put it towards the end of our property over here. Not too close to the house. Except the house. When we have a fire. Okay, perfect. Wow. This was awesome. <laughs> so you, if you come over here, you can see some other boulders I'm collecting over here. I'm, I'm making a big fire pit. Yeah, that's oh. what I told our viewers already. Oh, oh I'm sorry. <laughs> so actually, this might this might be too big. This might become a seat around the boulder pit. Oh yeah. Uh, but yeah, let's see if I can just roll it off real quick. All right, good. Wow, that went way better than I thought it was gonna. <laughs> we lost one of the pipes though. What? Oh. Wow. But that's okay. Okay. I'm surprised, yeah, the pipes were, I didn't even know if I was gonna need them. Okay. But I guess not. Like they were just to keep, try to keep the lawn from being torn up. Mm -hmm. But I No, I, it's fine. Wow. All yeah, right. So, now you know. I'm gonna do another one of these actually, <laughs> uh, but so stay tuned. <laughs> I don't know if you're interested. All right, thank you for watching. Bye. All right, so we're back with the second boulder that I'm moving today using this method as you as you just saw. The first boulder was like butter, no problems. This boulder is from <clears throat> this fire pit. So again, link in the description for for how my, uh, our, you know, me and my kids, we pried this boulder out. And 
to get it on the sled, we had to basically do the same technique with the ratcheting to get it up on the sled. It was a pain, but it's now on the sled, so let's get it out. Okay, looks like it's going to work out too. Nice, Doug. Yeah, we've been removing boulders and huge rocks from our property for a while now. Like this was a garden. I mean, it's, it's a garden, but before I planted anything here and put more soil, I had to really really dug out, dig out lots of rocks and boulders this was a lot of work two years okay uh, let's get back to the main rock what? <clears throat> all right all right another successful drag so i was just telling our viewers that it's been it's i mean it's been a process for us removing those rocks and boulders so i just showed that piece of yes yeah, soil there, right? We have removed a lot of boulders and rocks to prepare it for gardening. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and now we just got rid of that fire pit because we yeah. want to move it. The fire pit was in an awkward spot. So yeah, it was very awkward. I got more sled in there. Boulder I couldn't move by hand. So, hence the sled. Uh, yeah, it worked out. Boulders, you know, it's like Sisyphus around here. You're always rolling the boulder uphill and you're always rolling boulders around. So. <laughs> Ah uh, yeah, so thanks Custom for watching. I, I guess this technique works, so try it out for yourself. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.